I got into skating because of my older brothers, and I always kind of did what you know they did. I always looked up to them. So when they started skating, I wanted to branch out and try it with them, and then just like fell in love with it. There's a good skate scene in Ocean City, Maryland, but not a lot of girl skaters though, compared to here. It's insane. And I got invited to the girls' combi. This was in 2018, and I was like. Oh my God, these girls are doing these tricks on the coping. Are you kidding me? I was just like carving. They're doing inverts and front side airs and back side airs. Girls can do this, this is insane. That moment I was like, I'm gonna either push myself so hard and get good, or I'm gonna pick a different sport. I think California, especially San Diego, this is where skateboarding's at. This is the best place to be if you wanna have a career, and especially the contest aspect of it. This is the place to be. My first nationals was 2019. It was my first big contest, and I was super nervous. I was like, oh my God, this is a nationals, you know, a contest that helps you get points for the Olympics. So I just was going into it with a totally different mindset, and I think maybe put too much pressure on myself. I got a little nervous, but it was a really great experience. I did all the rest of the nationals, 2020, 2021, 2022. As soon as I heard about skateboarding being the Olympics, that was like the first major big goal in my mind. I was like, oh my God, I need to go to the Olympics. I feel like I got something inside of me to skate even harder. Being on Team USA just gives me butterflies when I think about it and it feels like a big skate family and when we all skate together and push each other and to be part of something that's really important means a lot to me and you know, skating with my friends. It's Ah, so fun. <laughs> I just want to continue to show my love for skateboarding through all these contests and achievements. The biggest difference from 2019 Ruby to now is I feel like I'm me. I feel like I know what I like now and also being myself.